guys, my TV here with some more summon as well action. Today we're gonna play with some cheaper units like Escher and Jutan. Now if you look closely, Escher is two speed slower than Jutan. So that means it, the, the, the chance of someone cutting in between after Jutan armor breaks is rather low. I'm gonna test today if we can if Escher can still work in 2017. We're currently ranked 3, we're up against a Chinese guild. Uh, let's start easy with the plus one over here. How about this guy? I'm actually looking for Sierra Orion Perna or Sierra Eno, but Sierra Orion Laika should be fine as well since Escher I think does pretty well against Laika. And we're gonna partner them with Usa. Chloe will do as well if you don't have a Usa. It's a pretty budget team so the Jutan over here, he's on, uh, I believe, double revenge and shield. So Usha's gonna get turn one, cause Usha is really high base speed, right? And then we have three buffs for Orion to strip. Hopefully he doesn't strip immunity. If he doesn't strip immunity, we will be able to snipe this Laika. That will be our focus here, to kill Laika first, because uh, when you have immunity, you're not really afraid of Ciara anyway. And for the first team, it doesn't really matter. As long as we bring the Siren and a stripper, we should be okay. Doesn't really matter what we bring here so let's just go in i think we should be fine just want to have some fun with sean we don't really see him that much considering he's like a really good ld net 5 okay so we're gonna start first oh my god this chasu 240 speed holy crap okay we gotta silence this guy because i don't want him armor breaking anything let's go for it nice we get it on him okay so Theomar is just going to do a default attack, it's going to hit Sean. fortunately no armor break, we need to stun here, go for the stun, we get it, okay I think right now we need to armor break uh, this guy, Oblivion, beautiful, okay we're going to strip it off him, and Sean's going to move because Sean has a speed buff, and Sean's going to be able to kill this one, okay next up we want to Oblivion this Kmon guy because the shields are pesky right, and then we do this and that's going to heal up. It's going to heal up my Sean, so uh, hopefully uh, this k -Moon, when he wakes up eventually, he's not going to target my Sean. What I'm going to do here is actually going to silence this Chasun, so she doesn't do Fallen Blossoms. And we continue poking at this k -Moon, right? We continue poking at him, so Chasun can't heal him. It doesn't matter what he does, Chasun can heal him for now. Can we get a stun here? We don't get a stun. If she violence, she violence into Fallen Blossoms. Of course, I called it, right? Of course, never mind. We armor break. Uh, we don't get it. That's too bad. And Tassar is my only armor breaker and he has a cooldown. So this is gonna take a while. And this Chasun is still continuing to violent every other turn. We need to keep Oblivion on him though. Right? Need to keep Oblivion on him just to make sure that we... I don't want to deal with the shield. And hopefully we can keep him stunned up. Right now I'm gonna silence Chasun again. Hopefully she does not violent out of that. And they're still targeting my Sean. I wish they would target my Tassarin because Tassarin is tankier. Armor break. Can we get it this time? One, two, three. Yes, we got it. In fact, we'll be violent. No, we don't violent, but it doesn't matter. This k is dead right now, so it's left for the Chasun. This one's in the back. Like, again, still much. You just bring a stripper, bring Tassarin. You're good. All right, you're good. Because usually comes that run Steel Mars, uh, especially this type of double support. And, and Steel Mars. you kill Steel Mars, it's in the back most of the time. Okie dokie, here's the highlight of the day. We've got shield buff already. Wish of immortality, we have three buffs. Orion strips immunity as expected, and Jutan cannot get the armor break off. I hate this game. I really hate this game sometimes, okay? So what we're gonna do here is, um... Let's sleep Orion, fuck it. Okay? Get the heal going, get some speed going, okay? Get the heal going, get some speed going. Next. We're gonna sleep this guy, if possible. No, did not work. You know, now I'm thinking. Oh, we get a counter, but we don't get the armor break. Now I'm thinking. Should I go for Ciara? Because Awusa's immunity is running out. So let's go for Ciara, okay? We get the stun. We get the armor break. Uh, but the problem is, I don't know if Ciara's gonna steal the turn. It would be bad if she steal the turn. Anyway, let's go for the sleep here. Two speed apart. And... Two speed apart, and yet Ciara steals the turn. I don't even know with speed buff. Two, you know what? Fuck it. Massacre. Kill this guy, so we get another turn. Okay, we get another turn, and then we get immunity again. Important that we get immunity again. Okay, because then Ciara can bomb us, right? Now we do this. 
I'm a very good hand. So, two speed apart, yet the Sierra is able to cut us every time. Fortunately, no armor break on Juju Tan. If not, that would be bad. I don't think Massacre is going to be able to kill, but uh, I see no harm. Let's go for it. Yeah, it's only going to do like what? Uh, it's only going to do like 12,000 without armor break. With armor break, probably would do a bit more than that, close to 30,000. But anyway, it doesn't matter. I believe this one is in the back. Unless Orion armor break, say. Nah, it doesn't even matter. This one's in the back right now. We didn't get to see a full nuke of Ezio with armor break. That was unfortunate. Yeah? Because. Somehow, somehow, the way attack bar works is that um, if you don't get it on turn one, if you don't get the nuke off on turn one, the attack bar disparity gets greater and greater because every 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 time someone moves, uh, it just I don't know the details. <laughs> it's all fucked up anyway. All right, when someone moves. Next, let's do the best plus two. Okay, now he has what is this? A best step, and then uh, we've got a uh, chasuit. We're gonna kill Perna twice here, and when we kill Perna twice, it's gonna be in the back. So, we're gonna stop Escher here. We don't need the speed leader because they're not running a speed leader, so my Usa is gonna outspeed anyway. I might as well get extra 20% 20, 20 uh, uh, from Escher's leader skill, right? Extra 21% HP. So, let's go for the HP. And about the one below, I don't think we can work with Sean here. So, we just go full water with the defense leader buffing for Rod's damage instead of the HP leader to buff Chow's damage. Uh, we're gonna try Chow again. This time, Chow is back on Vampire. Because <laughs> I don't have enough vitamins to spread around, okay? Anyway, that's not the main thing today. Escher, can you get one Escher nuke off today? I hope that happens. So we do this. So Perna's gonna move first because of the stat buffing, right? But I don't think Perna's gonna be able to kill me because there's no armor break. There's attack buff, yes, but there's no armor break. Three turn attack buff, I don't care why. Because right now, right? Perna? Okay, right now, you see, I do this, and then the attack buff is gone. The attack buff is gone because, wait a minute, am I going to be able to kill here? No, I don't get the kill, but Escher's going to be able to finish. I don't have to save Massacre because if you kill a target with Massacre, that's 9 point something K times 4. That's about 36,000, okay? You don't have to save Massacre because if you kill a target with Massacre, we need to sleep right now, right now. If not, Jutan's in big trouble. Damn it. Okay, no, 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 no. Okay. I'm a break, please. Okay, we get it. We need to sleep. Nice, 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 nice. Yeah, Massacre, I don't care. It's gonna kill. One, two, three, four. That's it. Dead Perna. Now we need to take a... Oh, we need to we need to save... Uh, we need to save poor Jutan over here. Let's... Uh, I don't think I need immunity now, do I? I better get immunity just to be safe because if Jutan gets armor broken, it, it gets it gets tricky, right? I want to save Jutan. Let's go for this one over here. He gets a shield off. So this stat is always gonna be able to cut my Jutan. It's always gonna be able to do that. Maybe I can focus on Chasun instead because it looks like. Wait a second. Can we? Yeah, Bastet is gonna cut, and so is Chasun gonna cut. Never mind. Let's just go for this. The unfortunate thing is that Jutan's armor break is only one turn. So unless we get a, a lucky revenge, we're not gonna get armor break onto Bastet, and we're not gonna be able to kill Bastet. We we can heal block though. Of course, resistance. Can we revenge? No, we can't. Let's see if we can do this. Fallen blossoms is coming though. That's the thing. Fallen Blossoms is coming. Oh, now we can get this going, okay? So we're gonna go here. Of course, the one time they get their speed synced up. The one time their speed synced up, Jutan doesn't land the armor break. Oh, this is so, so frustrating. This is so frustrating. I mean, the main threat is gone now, right? The main threat uh, being Kurna is gone. Can we go with Chasun instead? Of course not, Chasun always has high resistance, right? Let's continue healing, get more speed buff going, top of Jutan. Hopefully they quit Jutan, or Jutan Revengers or something. I don't know. Come on Jutan, land the armor break. Yes, thank you, finally. Finally. That's not enough! Don't tell me Fallen Blossoms! No! 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 Oh my god, we're gonna be here for a long time. Maybe I should swap one of uh, one of uh, Jutan's revenge, alright, since he's not revenging that much anyway. I should swap one of his revenge. Okay. Into uh <laughs> into uh, a destroy. Do you think it's better? Because otherwise, how are we ever going to be able to nuke this down? Okay, here's the one chance we have. Here is the one chance we have. Come on. No! We don't get it! There's no sense in doing this because we're not doing this with that. She's tanky. She's so tanky. 
fucking armor brick, man! <laughs> this is so frustrating! This is, you have no idea how frustrating this is. Like, there's no sense in me landing armor brick now, because we're not breaking the shield of the stat. Now we land, we don't even land the armor brick. Oh my god! This is a defense leader for fuck's sake, not a resist. This is a what? This is a front line? Is this a front line for stat? Is it, is this, that's what's going on here? Is it a front line for stat? There's no point in me doing this, because I know it does not kill. Right, so we, we get more speed again. Get speed on our team. <laughs> oh, this is so annoying. Uh, let's, uh, can we sleep this guy? No, we can't. No, we can't. Get immunity there. Please. Please. Urgh. Revenge, please, Jutan. Revenge, please. Come on, break. Who the fuck runs full resistance? On a Bastet nowadays! Like, who even uses Bastet frontline anymore? You go accuracy on Bastet, no? Come on! Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> we are gonna be here for a long time, guys. I, get, I don't even know what to do now. She gonna fall in blossoms. Okay, she does amuse. That's fortunate. That's fortunate. Okay. So, 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 so what happened here is Bastet crit. Bastet did crit. This is my chance. This is my chance. Finally. Fucking-ly. Finally. Oh, great. That was torturous, wasn't it? But hey. We still win. I mean, Asher still wins. Not for... Definitely not a strategy for the time constraint. Alright. Definitely not a strategy for, for the time constraint. But, uh... Yeah, you get the idea. It, 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 you successfully, you won't be able to take up the, the, the threat. Alright, and then you, you, you have to take forever to deal with the supports. Okay, because the werewolves don't have two turn armor. Two turn armor break would make Jutan actually legit. But the one turn armor break just makes him pretty shit. As in like, yeah sure he has the reflect damage and all, but against units that won't crit you, usually won't deal collateral damage. Even if you reflect, you know, like a Perna right there, two crits, you take more damage from the Perna than you deal to the Perna, you get what I'm saying? And the one turn armor break makes it so that it's really hard for you to get anything done, really. Yeah, so, so like right now, it's just a single Chasu. And because we only can land a one turn armor break, there's no way for me to, uh, you know, I have to use Massacre here. There's no way for me to actually, uh, you know, seal the deal. Because once an armor break goes away so easily, it doesn't matter. Like, like you, you can see right here, right? Juta and Escher are just, what, two speed apart. But it doesn't matter. Because the longer the game goes on, this two speed becomes suddenly like a uh, half an attack bar worth of speed. All right, Magic Church. Oh, Annabelle's in trouble. We need to sleep here. We need to sleep here. We don't get it. I actually need to freeze here. Okay, that's fortunate. We get that. Uh, just gonna go straight ahead, and uh, we're gonna adjust this this one here. Okay, just this that one. Annabelle, you need to sleep here. Can you get it? Nope. Okay, so we can get armor break now, and this means that Varad can do the new. We get it on all three. That's beautiful. Three turns armor break. You are not shaking that. Unfortunately, Chow got stunned up, but it doesn't matter. Absence zero is gonna pop and zero because we have a defense booster. Defense boosted for right. We're gonna take out this one here because the heals every second is annoying. Take her out. Oh, she's not out yet. Uh oh, Annabelle. Annabelle's in trouble. We take this one out first. Okay, we heal up here. Chow doesn't have justice. Chow just has a single hit. Should be able to do enough to kill Theomars. Yeah, let's pop the shield here. Can't see Vampire Chow shine because he didn't take any damage. Right. I have him on Vampire Nemesis so that. If he takes damage, well, then his attack power gets boosted up, and then he gets to leech all the health back from Vampire plus a heal after the turn. Yeah, since Violent, this it just that hasn't worked out for me since since the day I pulled Chow. On to the best plus three with this guy with the Shige face. In fact, the Chinese name I think pronounces as Shige anyway. Okay, we've got we'll bring Ezra below here. We just killed Perna twice, and we're fine. Once we kill Pernat twice, I believe Jutan can solo everything, right? So we just need to kill Pernat twice. How about the first one? 
We can actually do the same thing again here. But I'm gonna switch it up and use Chao as the main man with a speed leader galleon. So Iris can silence the stat or Theomars or whatever, hopefully, right in the beginning. Right? That's the idea here. We wanna pop and your get rid of Theomars, everything should be fine after. Curse of Beautiful first. He gets it off before me, and my Iris is in some trouble. She in some trouble right here because she can't shake this armor break unless she stuns Theomars. Oh! Oh! Okay! Okay, let's pop in the ore. Let's pop in the ore. Nice, 36,000 we popped in the ore. So right now Iris is stunned up, but she, does, she no longer has armor break, so that's good. Oh my lord, that's some good damage. Iris is it Iris is dead. Yeah, Iris is dead. Because crit bestat. And two time for the kill. Of course crit bestat, because that's the trend right now. Right? Max resistance. <laughs> right? Max resistance, max accuracy, crit bestat. It always happens. Yeah, let's go for this bestat right here. Pesky bestat. Didn't do anything because of the shield, I guess. Look at that. All the debuffs landed from this bestat. But it's okay. It's okay, do I want to do... Uh, no, let's just do Pirate Strike right here. Doesn't matter, Chao's gonna be able to do fine. Chao's gonna be able to survive. So just put one more armor brick on this step. Please don't tell me she has to shoot. Doesn't matter, let's do this. Galleon is a hero. Galleon is a hero that's gonna finish this one off. Oh my god, the glancing! Ah! <laughs> the stupid glancing from the stack. Dragon Knights are just... Just weak! Against weakening effects! I wish they could be immune to weak. Look at that, the weakened attack! They're just weak to this weak. They're just useless against. Uh oh, was that a mistake to put a dot on the. Yeah, that was a mistake. So we do this. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Dude, ah, Prowl's gonna heal up. Never mind. We do time to loot now. Okay, we do time to loot. Of course. Oh, we resisted that. Justice. Only 27,000 with attack, but oh, my child sucks, doesn't he? My child sucks. <laughs> my child sucks. Okay, super buffs and double strippers. Let's see if we can make this work. Can we? Okay, so far so good. So far so good. So far beautiful. Perna, sayonara. Sayonara. We're gonna. I'm gonna sleep this guy here. Nope, did not get it. Oh, enough, enough, enough of that. Let's kill Perna. I know he's stunned up, but I don't want Perna here. I just want to kill Perna. It doesn't matter. You kill Perna, the threat is gone, right? The threat is gone. I need to sleep Perna. Nope, we don't get it. We don't get it. Oh, dear, that hurts. Oh, dear. Oh, fortunately, no stun. No stun. Oh, but one second here. Is Perna going to move before Escher? I think so. I think so. I think Perna's going to move before Escher. Oh my god. Oh my god. Sweep this burner. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, shut up now. Enough already. Enough already. Uh, I wake burner. I wake burner. I don't care about that. I just want to kill burner. I, I need to kill burner before she violence so much that she revives again. Of course, she's gonna crit and stun my Usa. Of course, that's gonna happen. Of course, we're gonna be in big trouble right here. Jutan! Jutan! Wow, he stripped everything this jam in my sleep. Oh dear. One hit from Gemini crit took away the shield and then stripped immunity. These double magicians killing it right now. Can Usa do it? No, of course, Bruna's gonna quit. Nah, Usa's fucked. And Bruna is revived! <laughs> okay. Mistakes were made. I should have killed Gemini first. That guy killed me. Right? That guy killed me. I should have killed Gemini first. I thought I could get away with immunity. Not against double strippers. Time for random review of the day. Let's click this double things again. Go for the lightning. Let's go! No lightning. Never mind. What is this? Oh, uh, no, no, no. I, I don't like this guy. Some people say he's not bad, but... Uh, I, I think bounty hunters wise... I really only like Randy. Some people say Wayne is okay as an attack bar buffer, but uh, I attack bar buffers wise, I think you know they're just 
because Bernard, I feel I prefer Bernard because of the higher base speed, I think slightly higher. And there's others like Frigate, Orion, etc. I just don't think Wayne offers enough. So I think the only legit bouncy hunter is Randy, in my opinion. The rest, I don't like them at all. Alright, that's all the time we have for today. Thanks guys for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye-bye.